let's face it, the trees and shrubs and other plants that you're, that you're purchasing from Wild Tree, they're not cheap. And there's a good reason why they're not cheap. And, and here's why you should, you should get your trees from Wild Tree and not from a big box store. Here's the reason. First of all, the trees that, that the guys at Wild Tree have been producing are produced for wildlife. They're not produced for, as, as Jonathan Judy says, you know, the pedestrian market. Uh, people who go to the box stores and they buy something because it's pretty, okay? It's also pampered. It's been juiced up with all kinds of chemicals uh, before they get it to the store because they're gonna, you're gonna, they're, they only wanna have that plant look nice for the length of time it's in the store. Now you take that plant, which you may get on sale, take that plant, go out in, the, in these woods that we all work and live in and plant them and guess what happens? It's like putting a French bulldog in a wolf pack. You know, it's not, they're not gonna last. These trees that Wild Tree produces, they are conditioned for transition to harsh conditions. I mean, let's face it, you're, the places where you're planting your trees are wild places. And it's hard enough as it is to keep those trees alive, but if you buy the pampered ones, you know, what are you getting? Secondly, they're also, the plants are also being selected for their fruit and nut production in the case, case of, the, of those kinds of trees and shrubs. And a lot of plants that are used for landscaping in the country, they don't want a tree that drops a ton of acorns on the ground. They, they, as a matter of fact, I have some uh, research trees out here that we planted 40 years ago, some live oaks, which are great deer foods, uh, that haven't yet to produce an acorn. Why? Because at the time, the only source we had was, uh, was at nurseries, and they were trees that were bred to not produce acorns. So, yes, uh, the trees at, at Wild Tree are a little more expensive, but in the long haul, in the long haul, it's the best investment you can make.